Hi, Kingdom Kids. How are you? I miss you guys so much. I can't wait until we can get back together and see each other in our classrooms. How have you guys been doing? What have you been up to? I hope you guys are finding some fun things to do during this time and some exciting new things maybe to do in this time. And I just wanted to remind you that God is always here with you. And if you're feeling sad or lonely or or mad or, or you just want to talk to him, you just you can just pray to him and talk to him and he hears you no matter where no matter what day anytime he is there for you so if you're feeling upset or feeling sad just reach out to him and talk to him and tell him how you're feeling and he'll help you and he'll make all that go away i hope you guys are all doing well and once again i miss you guys so much and i can't wait to see you i hope we get to see each other soon bye have a good day Hi, it's Miss Cindy saying hello to you. And Miss Sue, hello. We really we miss, miss you. you. Uh, we miss your smiling faces. We miss hearing what you're doing and what you're doing at home. Hope you're being safe and giving lots of hugs to your mom and dad because I sure miss those hugs. And we will see you in the classroom soon. What's up, Kingdom family? How you doing? We miss you all. Just wanted to give everybody a shout out, say hey and we hope we can see you all soon. Bye guys. Hi everybody, it's Mrs. Masnicki. I miss seeing you in Kingdom Kids. I can't wait till we're back together again. In the meantime, just remember to talk with Jesus every day. He's listening here at my house and at yours, and he loves you so much. Y'all, hey it's Evan from Check-In. Just wanted to say hi before it starts raining again and the sun goes away. Hope you're all happy and safe and healthy. Love you all. See you again soon. I miss having kids climbing on me. It's not as fun without you. Bye. Hey guys, I miss you and I'll see you soon, I hope. Until then, just stay safe. Bye. Hi to all my mighty warriors from Kingdom Kids. I'm really missing you. I'm hoping you're doing really well and you're following <laughs> all the good things that we've been learning in Sunday school, like obeying your parents and helping out, showing kindness, and doing a lot of good things while you're at home, <laughs> like playing with your pets. And I can't wait till we get back together. So I'm sending you love and kisses, and I can't wait to see you again. Kingdom Kids, what's going on? I'm on the job site. I hope everyone's doing good. We have, well, some nice weather coming in, hopefully, for the next few weeks. So get outside, help your parents out, and remember, put on that full armor of God. There's nothing like it. The helmet of salvation. It's gonna save us all. Love you guys, we'll see you soon. Hi Kingdom Kids, this is Pastor Karen. I wanna tell you how important you are and how special you are to your teachers, and also how important and how special you are to Jesus. Even though we're not able to be with you right now, I wanna let you know that Jesus is always with you. He promises to never leave you and never stop being with you. He also says that he's your best friend and that he will be with you and help you with anything that you need. Yep, anything, that's pretty cool, anything that you need. So if you're doing school from home or learning to do new things right now, he's right there with you and he's ready to help you every step of the way. That's pretty awesome. We have a really, really awesome God. So during this time when things are a little bit different, I pray that you will feel God helping you with everything that you're doing and that he's your best friend ever. And I can't wait to see you all again at church. And until then, we all love you, Jesus loves you, and we'll see you soon. Hi. Hey everybody. We just wanted to say hi and let you know that we miss you. We miss our class. Yeah, I miss seeing you guys. We hope you're doing good. Uh, we can't wait to get together because we've been stacking up donuts here in the house and... Well, not all the donuts. Right, I can't keep them away from him. So he's eaten like 36 donuts. No, not 36. Oh, please, let's have 34. class soon. Next time we see you guys, we'll have donuts and... Fun. Yes. And it reminds me of what King David said. What did King David say? That... 
was glad when they said unto me, Let us Let's go, go unto the, the house of the Lord. Lord. We'll see you soon. Take care. Be safe. Bye. Hi, children. It's Miss Rose here. Just want you to know, hope you're doing well and I miss you a whole lot. Can't wait to see you back at Kingdom Kids Church soon. So I'm sitting outside and it's a really nice day outside. And it's springtime, I'm sure you know. Well, the spring makes me think of flowers. I really enjoy flowers. But in order to get a flower, we have to have seeds first that have to be planted in the ground. And it makes me think of a parable that Jesus talks about in the Bible where a farmer plants seeds and it's found in Luke chapter 8 verses 4 through 15. And in verse 11, it specifically says that the Word of God is the seed that is sown into our hearts. And the Word of God is the Bible. I know you know that because you all have Bibles and you get Bible books in class. So get your Bibles out. Look it up. How do we sow God's seed into our hearts? By reading or even listening to someone who's reading the Bible to us. It hap I happen to have some seeds here and um, some sunflowers and I'm going to plant them in a cup so they can grow. Just like seeds are ready to fall into good soil and grow into beautiful flowers, the Bible is full of God's Word seed that is just waiting to take roots in our hearts and grow into something beautiful in our lives. So you can do the same thing if you want with your parents. You can get some dirt, maybe plant some seeds. But I'm going to plant these seeds for you guys. When I see you again in class, I'm going to bring these to class and give you these plants that I've started to grow for you. And we'll see actually how much they've grown by the time we get back together. So read your Bible every day if you can. Maybe read with your parents if you can. And think about all the good word of God that you're sowing in your heart. So I'll see you real soon, okay? Take care. <gasps> We're live! Hi guys, it's Miss Kelly and Mrs. Who is this? Huggy. Huggy, it's Miss Shelby. And we miss you guys so incredibly much. And we can't wait to see you guys again soon. I know it's been a while since we've seen each other, but we just want to reassure you that this is all just temporary and we're definitely going to be able to hang out soon again. And we're going to have lots of fun. Maybe we'll have a party. And we'll have cookies and cupcakes and cake and lollipops. What do you think, Beauty? Yeah. Yeah? Don't tell Mom and Dad. Shh. Just kidding. But we will have a little party because we haven't seen you guys in so long and we miss you. And one of the things I would love is, I would love for you guys to share your stories with us with the stuff that you guys did while you were home. And maybe you guys played outside. Shelby, what's a couple things we did when we were outside? What did we find? Froggies. Froggies, what else? Um. Salamanders. Salamanders. Salamanders and birdies. So there's a lot of cool stuff out there that God created and we've been exploring in our own yard or there's some state parks that are still open. So if you guys can go out and ha get some fresh air and enjoy all the awesomeness out there and let us know when we get back together, we'd love to know the things that you guys saw and the things you guys did. And that would be really great to share with each other. No, don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> so we caught frogs and salamanders. We named them all kind of silly names too. So we just, we just want to see you guys very soon and we miss you so much. So let's get together soon and talk about all the awesome things that you guys did. And just want to encourage you guys that this is just temporary and not going to be lasting forever. And it's been a really weird time, but we really, really miss you. Me and Miss Jessica have been together quite a lot, a lot, thinking about you guys, thinking how we can talk to you guys, and things we can special we can do for you. So let's get together soon, and we'll have a lot of fun the first day we get back together. In the meantime, you guys, be really good to your mommies and daddies and grandmas and uncles and aunts, whoever you're hanging out with. Be super cool to them, okay? Because this is really hard on a lot of people. So we're all kind of weirded out by this stuff, but 
we don't got to worry about anything because we got Jesus and it's no big deal, right, Shaw? Yeah. Right. No, we don't touch that yet. <laughs> so try to get outside, guys, as much as you can. Even if it's raining, go play in the rain. Go get wet and yucky and have some fun. And if your parents get really mad at you for doing that, you can have them call me, okay? And I'll take care of everything. Just kidding. So anyway, guys, we miss and love you very much. And hope to see you guys soon and love to talk about all the cool things you guys have done. Um, and maybe even some of the stuff that wasn't so cool. We can talk about that too. It'd be really good stuff to share with our class and stuff we can pray about. Or if you guys had any really cool things that have happened, have somebody write it down and bring it to us so we could share it. Or you guys can just share it when we're together again. So we just love you guys so much and I know your teachers have probably been reaching out to you for those of you in school and saying how much they miss you well we miss you just as much so that's why we've made this video and if you guys have the ability to make a video back to us that would be so awesome like really awesome so see if you can do that for us see if like you can have somebody take a video for us of you guys so we can see your beautiful faces instead you're just stuck looking at our faces and we really want to see yours too so anyway guys love you much and we will see each other soon why because god is awesome he is good and he will make all of this mess go away and when we get back together we'll have more fun than probably we ever have so we will see you soon guys love you Mwah.